A senior official from Sichuan province has officially been dismissed for corruption. Li Chuancheng was taken away for questioning on December 2nd, and while most see his ousting as part of the Chinese regime's new fight against corruption, is there something more to his downfall? Sichuan province second in charge, Li Chuancheng, has been sacked. State-run media reported today that the deputy party chief was dismissed, suspected of, quote, serious discipline violations. Li is the highest level official to be toppled under new leader Xi Jinping's campaign against corruption. But Li's political ties suggest there may be more to his fall from power. During his political career in Sichuan province, Li worked under China's former security chief Zhou Yunkang. Where can you find one official that's not corrupt in China? This case is targeting Zhou Yunkang and his allies, including Bo Xilai. Xi Jinping is trying to establish his rule and win popular opinion. Zhou Yunkang is a close ally of former communist leader Jiang Zemin. Until November, Zhou was the head of China's security apparatus, the Political and Legislative Affairs Committee. His former membership in the top ruling circle, the Politburo Standing Committee, gave the PLAC nearly unchecked powers in suppressing dissent. The PLAC's political rank was downgraded during November's power transfer, and some believe Li Chunqing's ousting is a preemptive move against his higher-up allies. It is certainly like this in politics. They go from the bottom to reach the top, to bring down the leader. They need to take away his subordinates. If you go for the head first, his supporters may still be there. If they retaliate, it could be costly. Li was taken away on December 2nd for questioning. The exact allegations against Li Chuncheng are unclear. Shen Yong, an official from Sichuan's provincial capital Chengdu, has claimed online Li engaged in bribery and favoritism during his reign as Chengdu's party chief. Shen also implicated Li's wife in mishandling donations for the 2008 Sichuan earthquake relief efforts.